That's the one. I'm sure of it. May you build wonderful and lasting friendships in your new house. Well then, with that taken care of, it's time to decide which of us will supervise which house. Am I going to choose here too? Yes, it turns out we just underwent a last minute roster change. I guess you two haven't met. This is Professor Yuritsa, our weapons instructor. Hello. <laughs> yeah, hello. Nice meeting you, uh, sir. Don't load me up with too much homework, all right? <laughs> Do my ears deceive me? Or is that curiosity I hear in your voice, Professor Yuritsa? I thought all the houses were the same to you. Perhaps you should be in charge of our new student's house, hmm? I don't care. You decide. Well, you'll certainly hear no objections from me. Professor Manuela, you and I can take charge of the remaining houses. Okay, so Yuritsa literally replaces Byleth. What? It's decided already? I was at least expecting a fight. Maybe some hair pulling? And as for you, my mysterious new student, I look forward to getting to know you much, much better throughout the year. The gall of these people making decisions for you. It's enough to make one's head spin. What are you talking about? I got to choose my own house. I feel like that's a big decision. I care more about that than who my professor is. Right. In any case, I'm looking forward to learning from you, Professor Yuritsa. I'll inform you of our first mission soon. Sorry, what mission? Oh, did we fail to mention that? Each month, every house in the Academy is given a mission entailing some form of service to the Church. Students of the Golden Deer are now playable! Yo, Claude! Lawrence is a soldier. Hilda's a fighter. Oh, Hilda and Raphael are like Edelgard. What Edelgard's combat was. You're a monk. Classic. Fighter. Fighter? Oh, but you can use bows. Okay. Also a monk. Also a soldier. Okay. These probably evolve into later classes. Sorry, but do I have this right? This person just enrolled at the Academy and now they have become a member of our house? Yeah, that's pretty much the deal. Right, Professor Yuritsa? Yes. I love how you can bump into someone in the woods one night and suddenly you're living under the same roof the next. I knew we had a thing. Hey, <laughs> me too, Claude. Me too. Anyway, welcome to the Golden Deer House, where the only rule is make your own rules. Kidding, of course. Or am I? The point is, you're one of us now. And it's very good to have you here. Well, the term's only just started. The church must really like you if they're letting you join partway through. You have to be pretty skilled to get that kind of treatment. Well, I believe it. I mean, how many people our age can cut it as full-fledged mercenaries? I definitely see why the church was interested. And I can't wait to train together. And I can't wait to eat together! Or work out. You wanna go work out? I'm just gonna say it right now, no. Never in my life. Keep dreaming. Seriously, you need to put some muscles on that coat rack you call a body. Bulk up, like me. I really hate Raphael. Hmm, I don't think these strange shirt buttons look is for everybody. Any more meat on those bones and our friend here would be downright scary. <laughs> Got him. Our new friend's build is perfect as is. Wouldn't you agree, Marianne? That's a marriage proposal if I ever saw one. Oh, well, I don't... Uh... Okay, okay, everyone just loosen up. And hey, it's not like we haven't met already, so just sit back and make yourself at home. I would not take after Claude if I were you, new blood. Honestly, if you wish your time here to be fruitful, you would do well to follow my lead. Um, I think Professor Yuritsa wants to say something. Remember your mission? Every word, Professor. We are to crush what remains of the Iron King's thieves who attacked our camp. And with their boss Costas out of the picture, the runts that are left should be easy pickings. They can't be anything too special if we're getting them as homework. Good. Prepare yourself. Of course, Prof. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, so that whole Yuritsa up and vanishing thing? 
Best to just get used to it. Well, I for one am excited to show off my skills by beating up on some bandits. I don't suppose I could be excused, or... Um... We're all in this together, Marianne. Don't worry, you'll be fine. Besides, the newbie here already sent them packing once, so this should be easy peasy. So long as I'm here, this will all work out just fine. Yo, more points for Marianne, let's go. Are you sure? <sighs> That's a relief. Anyway, we're all participating in this mission. Church's rules. I didn't make them, so the only thing we can do is work together. And we're gonna lean pretty heavy on our mercenary buddy here. Hope that's okay. I won't let you down. Dude, I am excited. Really excited to play this game from a student perspective. Two weeks later! How is Edelgard talking to Yuritsa? There you are, Yuritsa. I have word from the knights. It is time? Yes. The bandits have fled north into the canyon bordering Count Rose land in the kingdom. But the knights have cut off their escape, and now stand ready to provide whatever support the students may require. We'll leave at once. I needn't remind you this is the first real battle for some of our charges. I trust you will keep them safe. Though I likely do not need to worry with an old hand like you at their side. No, you don't. You there, it's time for the mission. Gather the others. About time we saw some action. Lost sight of them? Ashamed to admit it, but yes. It's possible someone magicked the bandits away, but why go to that kind of trouble for a handful of highwaymen scum? So be it. We'll follow the blood scent. Right, of course. We'll follow... Wait, what? We're leaving. Everyone, follow me! Hey, uh, Professor Yuritsa, are you... And the way he goes. Guess we better get after him. We're still on a mission, after all. Pathetic. Slow down, Professor. You're making it hard for us to... Oh. Well, this is something. What happened to all these people? Dead by my hand. Are these the bandits we have been chasing? Who knows? It's not like you can tell they're bandits just from looking at them. Well, Professor, are they the villains we're searching for? Most likely. I caught them trying to escape to that fortress. Did I ever ask who Eureka's voice is? It sounds familiar, but I don't know. You know what it sounds like? It kind of sounds like, um, Jao from Tales of Zillia. I'm not sure if that's the voice, though. Okay, does it have to be so dark and spooky? It must be their hideout if they were trying to shelter there. Then let's quit standing around and seize the place. Might even find some nice gear in the process. I concur. As nobles, we would be remiss to let the people suffer at the hands of these rapscallions one minute longer. So you want to go in there? Yeah, you know what? I think I'll stay here and make sure the outside is safe. <laughs> right, Marianne? You with me? Of course. We don't belong in a dangerous place like that. We'll be heroes if we manage to take out the entire bandit outpost. This is the kind of stuff I live for. I hate that I only got points for my least favorite character in this whole game. Yeah, let me at him. I'll crack those guys like walnuts. It seems like opinions are split, but the thing is, we're still on a mission, and that means we leave the decision making to Professor Yuritsa. And I say, enter the fortress, dispatch any bandits you find. But there's no cause for concern. I see no signs of life. There can't be more than a handful, or none at all. I'd be happy with the none option. <laughs> My grandpa told me empty forts have ghosts in them. Ghosts? I mean, uh, how childish. Everyone knows there's no such thing. Yeah, very convincing. We're hunting bandits, not banshees. So can we please just get this over with? My Scythia, don't tell me that you're... You know what? Probably better not to ask. You folks must be pretty confident considering how much you're horsing around. 
Just be careful some brute doesn't take you by surprise. Yeah, we'll just need to watch each other's backs. Eyes peeled, everyone. Oh, finally, we're gonna get to do some battling with everyone. So how does it work with, like, benching people? Got Hilda, got Chez. Uh, no. Can I take out Lorenz? Army status. How can I, how can I take off Lorenz? Change deployment? No. Oh. Can I take out Lorenz? Do I have to use Lorenz? I'm assuming I have to use these characters because the game hasn't, um, told me about switching units. Yo, there are supports? Oh, dude. We are getting every support if I can help it. So I'm assuming I can't take anyone out. I probably have to use this team. Which is annoying. Oh yeah, I can't. Okay, okay, I see. By the way, I am i haven't really been looking at chat because I'm trying to get through the early game. But I think we're pretty deep in there now. It's great the game gives an overview of the houses, so you can make a decision when I haven't played the original game. Yeah, it really seems like this is like kind of a retelling of Three Houses. Which honestly, I'm kind of down for. I like Three Houses, you know, teaching the students was cool, but I'm looking forward to playing it as a student, like from a student perspective. That'd be really cool. And some of the older FE games, Perm Death was... Can actually prevent you from beating the game. Yeah, yeah, that's why I don't like- That's why I'm not really a big, older Fire Emblem person. I've only played Three Houses and Shadows of Valentia. And they were both great games. Begin the battle. I hate that I have to use Lauren's, but whatever. Hilda, what's up? I can't even skip my turn! A assigning Agitants. Ooh, this is like, um... Three Houses. Press L, display a quick menu, approach an ad like unit and press L and Y to assign them as your adjutant. That's cool. With adjutants assigned, active unit stats will be raised based on the adjutant's class. Oh, there's like support talents. Yo. Okay. How do we want to do this? Is that an item? Let's try this. Let's see how this goes. Now it is my turn. There is nothing I can. Not a problem. I've got this. I'm playing as Hilda. Hey, we got intruders. Come on, they're just bandits. Yo, it's so awesome. Let's do this. <laughs> Dude, giant rock. Now, let us bring it down. What's up, loser? Face is mine. Oh, dude, this is a dream come true. Go down. Hey, Shez, how's it going? Agitant? I got a perfect dodge there. That was totally intentional. Yo, returning axe is sick. It's over, losers. I'm going to get the stun gauge if I can help it. Gate Coopers and Gate Coopers? Keepers and Doors. Oh, opens a gate. Self explanatory. I require the stun gauge. 
I guess what? Swinging Fury. Let's get it. This gatekeeper's mine. Alright, we should probably... Can I zoom this out? Does it have to be this close? Let's try this. Oh, I can't even go there? Interesting. Oh, because the gate... Right, right, right. That makes sense, actually. Dude, the combat is, um... It's definitely getting a lot better. Like, I when I when I was controlling Shez in the very beginning, I was like... That's a nice finisher. I was like, I'm not really sure about this combat, but now I'm like... Now I'm vibing with it. I really just can't hear the characters. In battle. Let's try that. I just think they made the characters too quiet. I tried to stop them. What's up, loser? Let's secure the interior. Yeah, I love that. That move is great. Seize the bandit bases. Now it is my turn. Oh, you get that guy, Lawrence. Let's try this. Let's see how this goes. Where's Shez at? Oh, right, Agitant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, makes sense. I, I did the wrong thing. Sorry. I'm sorry. Now it is my turn. There is nothing I cannot do. You're going for that guy, so I will go for that guy. I'll go over here because they're going for them. Yeah, I love this whole ordering around people thing. Ba, ba, bum, 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 bum. This is, uh, what's his name called? Tempest of Seasons? Hey, look, a treasure chest. We can get it open if we have a key. How does one get chest keys? Uh, I was all ready to grab a nice haul from that chest. And now those He's that loser. Oh, I am Hilda. Oh, a thief appeared. There, there's the key. Did I hear the faint jingle of a key? I'm getting that key. That key is mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. I, I played Fire Emblem. Watch over their poor souls. Hey, loser, what's up? Got myself a bucket of butt kicking. Ow, how dare you? Giant rock. You are in the presence of best girl. Cower. There you go. Now Shez can be back here. I'm getting this stun. I want to see Hilda's uh, special. That's why I'm playing as her a lot. Also, she's amazing. Ow, how dare you? Oh, special? Let's get it. Oh my word! That is amazing. Well, I might be biased, but Hilda's is the best special in the game. It's just that easy. Hilda, Hilda. See Steve's base. Nice. So what's next? Search the basement. Alright, you know what? This way I can say I played as everyone. Oh my goodness, of course the roses as his effect for an attack. Sword Reign of Death! Dude, I love Sword Reign of Death! So awesome. I need someone to go up there and grab that, um... I know, Hilda's bad. Is there anyone that can actually take that guy? Let's try this. Yeah, Claude, you get that guy down there. Dude, this game is amazing. Yeah, go for that guy, Shez. I'm going for the chest key. What's up, loser? I am going to play as all the characters relatively evenly. A lot less with Lawrence and Raphael, but I'll use them a little bit. 
Because I want to see all the specials in the game. And I do want all the supports, so... I'm going to have to balance everyone. 